in this uh, video we'll see uh, we'll write a program that uh, how to create a program using for loop so that can find the sum of all the even numbers between a definite number that we can give a user input and it will print the value so for that so uh, let me initiate initiate a variable so let me write even underscore sum this is a variable i want and the whose initial value is zero the sum value is zero so next i'll write i want to include in a for loop okay so let's say i want to calculate the summation of all the even numbers between 0 to 10 or 0 to 50 let's say so for that i'll write a for loop for then i'll take a variable that is a num i'm just taking a variable you can take x y z i or anything else so i'm just taking a number so i want this this number should be a even number so how to ensure that so we'll write for num in range so that is the normal uh, function of uh, uh, for loop so what is the range so the range i will initialize here so the range will be like we'll start from 0 okay and then let's say i want up to maximum 50 it will count the sum okay so now if i write only in range 0 to 50 then it will go on 0 1 2 3 4 continuously it will go means it will make a sum of all the numbers between 0 to 50 but i want all the even number i know that even number comes after a gap of 2 so like 0 2 4 6 8 so i'll write one more variable here which is 2 that means the for loop will go first for 0 then for 2 then for 4 and like this it will go on so to make a even number i just what i did i made a gap of 2 that means every time it will not count all the numbers it will go 0 2 4 like a gap of 2 it will count so next is what i want to find the sum sum of what so my total sum is even sum that i have declared initially is equals to so the initial value i'll write again even sum plus the number which number currently the for loop whichever number it is going on it will add that number okay now after all the loop is completed from 0 to 50 the final even sum value will be the addition of all the even numbers here so after that what i will do i will print this value i will not print inside the for loop that's why i am going out of the indentation and here i will write print so one function you can write f inside the column if you write it is easy to write the variable as well that as well as the text so how to write we will write the sum of all the even numbers so we have taken up to 50 all the even numbers up to 50 each then in curly bracket you can write the final variable name that is even sum okay so that's our program so if i run this program so you can find the sum is equals to 600 it is showing me the value as 600 now let us do some minor changes to it and i want that 50 is not fixed i can take a user input okay so for that what i can do so i'll create a number here let's say maximum number that i'll take from the user so maximum number is equals to i'll take it from the user that's why i'll write input enter i'll write a message here how much up to what value you want to print the even number sum so i'll write enter the maximum number okay now the user can input the maximum number now here the problem is if directly i take this variable then it will be a string variable so for that i need to convert that to integer so for that i'll write int here and put all these things in a bracket so now the input value will automatically get converted to integer or else you can do another step also now what is my maximum number maximum number is max num variable that i have taken and instead of taking 50 here i'll write here maximum number now what it will do so whatever number you enter here 0 up to that number with a gap of 2 or with an interval of 2 it will do the sum and here also we can change that if 50 is not now fixed so i'll write inside the curly bracket i'll write max num okay now what it will do so let us see if i run this code it is asking that what is the and enter the maximum number let me write 10 here so it will add the the sum of all the even numbers up to 10 is 20 so it's like 0 plus 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 plus 10 plus 12 like this the value will be 20 okay up to 10 so 0 plus uh, 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 that's it now if i run it again and i can enter any value let's say 100 then here the value will be 2450 so like this you can little bit tweak the program 
so that you can take a user input here. Now, one thing you can try here that instead of this program is only fixed to find all the number between your uh, uh, even numbers between uh, uh, 0 and the maximum number. So, you can print the odd numbers as well. So, for odd number what you can do you can start from 1. So, instead of 0 I can start from 1 here. So, after 1, 3, 5 like this it will go on if I run this and if I enter 10 now the value is 25. Now, it is doing the addition of all the odd numbers just a small change and it can create it. So, basically our program is 0. So, let us stick to that. So, I will write 20 and it is the and, and the sum of all the even numbers between 0 to 20 is equals to 90. So, like this you can write a code in the next video we will see some other interesting program.